Hi there. Um, I'm going to try to move through something pretty quickly to show you the process. Um, my cat is now rubbing against my camera, so it's shaking around a little. <laughs> Don't mind him. Um, anyway, I think I'm just going to do this with very little conversation, um, maybe a couple pointers as I go. Uh, this is a basic process of making a bowl. I've got, I don't know, I don't measure my clay. It's, uh, I just, uh, there he is. <laughs> I just don't. So, first you slap it down. I like to kind of slam it into shape here. Be probably better with music instead of the slamming sound. Hey, Mooch. He likes the studio. Just centering the clay is something a lot of people really struggle with, and it's it becomes pretty much second nature, but uh, even for pros, I suppose not pros, but for people who do a great deal of pottery, um, it can be frustrating. You can have a day when you just can't center. I hope this isn't one of them. I don't think so. We shall see. Called, this is called coning it up. Essentially what you're doing is you're taking, you don't want to just center the exterior of the form because um, the clay on the inside could be very uneven in one way or another. And so what you're getting at is you're getting into the, the sort of middle of the mass by coming up in this way and pushing down the whole mass should become more integrated, balanced, and centered. So that's really what we're going for here. I personally like to anchor my left elbow into my left hip because it gives me a a good deal of control. So that's getting pretty centered. Unfortunately, my bat feels a little wobbly, so that may be challenging as I go forward. You'll see, I have one bat that's a little funky, and maybe this is it. I keep meaning to mark it, and then I keep forgetting to mark it. That is the centering process. Just threw a little clay on the floor there. My cat is about to sit on some bowls I've already made, so those may end up in the recycling bin if he gets too, too excited over there by the window. Now I'm gonna go down. I wanna leave a fair amount of clay at the base of this, about that much, because um, I wanna play around with a you know, a taller foot that's going to be very much part of the part of the form of the, the finished bowl. That it's not just, okay, here's a foot and it's sitting on a table, but that the foot itself has kind of something to say. And then I'm coming out. This is the this is the wonky bat, unfortunately. And now my cat wants to go out. So I will be back in a moment.